All right, hey, welcome to Custom Metal. We're going to give you the grand tour um, of what we do and what we use to create the uncreated. As first of all, we have a, a saw here that um, I don't know how we survived without it, if you've seen what we used before, but it's a fully automatic. You can program this thing and just let it run and it'll cut all by itself. What people say when they come into a shop like this is, what do you guys do? It's hard to explain what we do. We do all kinds of fabrication of metal. Just like a cabinet shop makes wood stuff, we make metal stuff. It takes all kinds of different tools. We have welders of all kinds. So it's right here behind me is our big MIG. Big power supply up there. It's on a movable arm, so we can move it all around the shop. And we can do big, heavy stuff right here in the middle of the floor. It's a large, big welder. We have a couple small welders that we can move over this way. We have a small portable 110 MIG. It's a solid wire, comes out of a gun. This is our small machine. We have some other larger machines, a few of these laying around. We're doing all our general purpose welding. We also have in the corner, if it's not too dark, there is a TIG welder. So we do TIG welding of stainless, aluminum, titanium, regular steel. So a big part of fabrication is attachment as well. So we have a number of different ways of welding pieces together. We also have to cut stuff, like you might have seen before the saw. Automatic saw, we have a shear that does shearing a flat bar, it does angle iron, it also does punching of bolts, round, square, oval, whatever. So we can do cutting on this. We also have a vertical band saw. So we have horizontal bandsaw, we have vertical bandsaw. We also have a lathe for doing certain turnings of round and hex bars and squares. We also have a bridge port mill. So we can do milling of light machining, manual machining. We also have a large drill press. We have an assortment of drills. So we can drill any size large up to large size drills, drill holes. And then back over here, we also have a four spindle drill, which we can do tapping, drilling, countersinking, all in one procedure. We come around this way, you can see we have smaller drills, just quick little pilot drills for drilling all different kinds of holes. We also have some very primitive, but effective bending type of pieces. So we can bend heavy pieces as thick as this for special fabrication. We also have different ways of grinding metal. We have belt sanders. We have bench grinders. We have wire wheels. We even have a polisher attachment. So there's all kinds of different things that we do. So it's hard to explain what we do. But we have all these tools to make it much easier. Well, here's a pipe threader. I'd like to point that out. We do pipe threading. Um, we have small hand grinders for hand grinding of small pieces. A few different types. A number of clamps. We're clamping stuff all the time. We're always clamping material to hold it in place as we're tapping into it. Another form of cutting is our plasma cutter. We have a small plasma cutter so we could do like torch cutting or uh, oxy acetylene torch cutting or plasma cutting. Large work tables. I need a big place to work so I can attach pieces, assemble pieces, clamp it all together and build whatever I need to build right here. 